And welcome back to Sunrise. Our time is 6.15. The Stars return to the Indianapolis Motor Speedway this morning, testing their latest cars on the track. And whether you brave the weather to check it out or not, you might want to head to the track next month. Our Matt McCutcheon shows us the big changes you're sure to notice. Good morning. The weather certainly doesn't feel like it, but it's hard to believe we're just a couple of weeks away from the 100th running of the Indianapolis 500, and there is a lot going on here behind the scenes. We're joined right now by Alex Dameron, communications manager here at the track. Good morning to you. As we take a look around, people are working, and there's a distinctive notice from level one and level two of the stands. What's going on? Yeah, absolutely. So right now, viewers are looking at our Project 100 along the front stretch of the Indianapolis Motor Speedway. Uh, so right now, um, they're seeing a new roof deck. It's actually 13 feet higher and is allowed for three rows of additional seating that we've not had before. Um, and they're seeing live right now the installation of the first stadium seats uh, in the history of the Indianapolis Motor Speedway. So they still have that distinctive uh, green color um, that fans have come to know and love and expect here. Um, but they're new and they, and they certainly are comfortable. I had a chance to test one out the other day. Um, so it's very exciting stuff. And this is part of the Project 100 celebration for this year. So these are some brand new items never before here at the track. And also for today, this really begins sort of a, a first test of the cars on the track. Absolutely. So we're really excited to welcome the stars of the Verizon IndyCar Series to the Indianapolis Motor Speedway today. Um, they're going to hit the track uh, starting at 10 a.m. Fans are welcome to come. Uh, you can sit in the turn two viewing mounds, um, but it's really exciting. They're going to be out here testing their cars, uh, making sure that really as a series, we're ready to put on the best show possible in May. And there's a lot of specifications that you really want to get your car out because it's been, you know, something that's been under construction pretty much since last season to see how it works. Yeah, absolutely. So every week, uh, these drivers are learning more about their cars as they hit different stops along the series, but this is really an opportunity to, to get to the Indianapolis Motor Speedway ahead of the Angie's List Grand Prix on May 14th and the 100th running of the Indianapolis 500 on May 29th. Um, see how your tires are responding, take a look at the aerodynamics of the car and make sure everything's in line. All right, thanks much for joining us. So again, a lot of activity here, both behind the scenes with things like the seats, as well as getting those cars back out on the roads for the 100th running of the Indianapolis 500. Back to you.